Monkeys don't get chicken pox. Oh, I wish I were a monkey. But little girls do. Which is why George was going to the opera instead of Betsy. Oh, you guys are so lucky. Ah, uh, no we're not. Operas are boring. Ugh. Don't pay any attention to him, George. Hansel and Gretel is wonderful. It's magical. Listen, isn't that pretty? Uh-huh. Yeah, pretty high. Shh! This is my favorite part of my favorite opera. It's where the Dew Fairy helps Hansel and Gretel. Oh. Isn't she beautiful? They only do this opera every few years, and I have to miss it. Oh, we're all going to miss it if we don't hurry. Have fun. Promise you'll tell me all about it. <laughs> oh. Ah. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Sorry, it, it's my monkey's first opera. <laughs> With me, both my hands I offer thee. Right foot first, left foot there, round about and back again. George thought the boy and girl must be Hansel and Gretel. I would dance, but don't know how, when to jump or when to bow. Show me what I ought to do, so that I may dance like you. With your foot, you tap, tap, tap. With your hands, you clap, clap, clap. Right foot first, left foot there, round about and back again. The opera was everything Betsy had said it would be. Hansel and Gretel danced and played in a magical forest. There was a sandman who lived in a tree. Who made them fall asleep. and a dew fairy who woke them up. Then they found a house you could eat. But the house belonged to a scary witch who wanted to eat them. Hocus pocus, now comes Yucus. Children, watch the magic head. Eyes are staring dull as lead. But Hansel and Gretel outsmarted the witch. The bell was broken, and all the gingerbread men turned back into kids. Good job! Oh, it was incredible! <laughs> George liked it so much, he got the music. Wow. I just wish I could have gone with you. Crummy chicken pox. This will keep your head dry. <laughs> hey, George, you look like you could be in Betsy's opera. Did he? Huh? <gasps> he sure did. In fact, he could be all the people in Betsy's opera. He could do the opera for Betsy all by himself. <laughs> the first thing George needed were costumes. Next, he needed the music. Uh, what's going on? <laughs> you want to listen to the opera now? Uh, George, why is there a duster on your head? <laughs> oh, I get it. Since Betsy missed the opera, you want to act it out for her. Brother, come and dance with me. Both my hands I offer thee. Right foot first, left foot third, round the boat and back again. This was going to be harder than he thought. <laughs> 